Hi, um, my name is Neeraj Dhar. I'm a research scientist at Vido University of Saskatchewan. I've uh, recently joined Vido uh, from the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology in, in Switzerland. Uh, so my research group here studies uh, Mycobacterium tuberculosis, the, the bacteria that causes the infection tuberculosis in humans. On World TB Day, we celebrate the, the discovery of this bacillus, but uh, even today, it, it's caused a significant mortality and morbidity whole, uh, worldwide. And there are more than uh, about 1.5 million deaths that, ha that happen every year. The, the challenge, like we do have effective drugs uh, that, that can treat TB, uh, but the challenge is that the, the regimen is quite long. It, it takes six months to treat a, a TB patient. So that's what is the kind of the focus of my research in my laboratory. Uh, I'm trying to understand uh, why does it take why does it take such a long time to treat TB and how can we kind of make this process a bit faster? Uh, because this will not only help us um, kind of have a better control for the for the disease, but also uh, it will prevent development of drug resistance, uh, multi drug resistance, which is which is a huge problem in TB. Hi, my name is Jeffrey Chen. I'm a research scientist and principal investigator at uh, Vido, the University of Saskatchewan. Uh, my research focus is on TB or tuberculosis, which is caused by the bacterium, Mycobacterium tuberculosis, as well as uh, other very similar uh, bacteria. The tuberculosis is a infectious lung disease that affects both humans and animals, so particularly livestock and certain wildlife species. And it is uh, quite problematic uh, in many parts of the world, including Canada. So TB poses a serious problem in terms of human and animal health. And the, the research that my lab is uh, focused on is to understand or better understand how the TB bacteria engages with the immune systems of uh, a person or an animal that it infects and uh, what it does in, term, in terms of establishing uh, uh, long-term infections. And the hope is that with the knowledge that we can we gather from, from these efforts, that we can develop better vaccines and uh, medicines that are urgently needed for both to deal with and combat both human and uh, animal TB.